Number 10, Charleroi, Belgium. Omar Cook penetrates, but Andre Riddick stands in his way. No, no. Number 9, Malaga, Spain. A great pick and roll execution. Christoph Walters of Udicaja sends a bounce pass to Joel Freeland for a wicked slam. Number eight, Barcelona, Spain. Pietro Aradori tries to score, but Fran Vasquez denies him with a block. Not in my house. Number seven, Ljubljana, Slovenia. Danny Green to Sasu Salad, to Alexander Chapin, to Ratko Varda, to Damir Markota, and back to Varda for an easy basket. Great teamwork by Union Olympia. Number six, Istanbul, Turkey. Guy Panini of Maccabi Electra missed from downtown, but Tal Burstein gets the ball and sends a great one-handed pass to Sean James for the slam. Number five, back to Barcelona. Chuck Aitzen of FC Barcelona Regal dives for a loose ball. Juan Carlos Navarro gets it and connects with Bonnie and Dong for the one-handed tomahawk dunk. Number four, Kaunas, Lithuania. After Tibor Fleiss misses, Tadas Klimavicius gets the rebound and finds Mantas Kalnietis, who sends a long pass to Sunny Weems for a wild slam to delight the Zalgiris faithful. Number three, Cantu, Italy. 7.8 seconds to go and Bennett Cantu up by one. Georgi Shermadini misses a free throw. Kyle Hines gets the rebound and runs to the other end to win it for Olympiacos. But Shermadini reaches back in time to block his shot and give Cantu its third win. Number two, Kaunas, Lithuania. End of the first half. Predrag Shuput of Bro's Basket misses a shot. Sonny Weems gets the rebound, races down court, and beats the buzzer with a long bomb from way downtown. Unbelievable. And the number one play of the week, Nancy France. Kevin Serafin soars for a huge block on Mosa Badian, who runs the other way and rejects Reggie Williams' shot. Oh, my. effort that led Sluk Nancy to a huge 90-85 victory over Turkish Airlines EuroLeague powerhouse Caja Laboral and thrilled the French home crowd resulted in forward Nicolas Batum earning his second to win MVP of the week honor so far this season in spectacular fashion. Batum, who was also the win MVP in week two, did not leave the floor for a second on Thursday until his team had wrapped up its second victory in Group B. Along the way, Batum did his damage in every which way for Nancy. He finished with 21 points on high percentage shooting from all spots on the court. Four for six on two pointers, two for three from downtown, and seven for eight at the free throw line. At the same time, he was the top rebounder for the winners with nine his career high. He also dished four assists, blocked a shot, and drew seven fouls. As usual, Batum was at his best down the stretch with four of his rebounds in the final quarter and seven points in the game's last five minutes. Batum, who began his yearly career in 2006 as a 17-year-old, has returned on a mission to help Nancy and French basketball make its mark again in the Euroleague. 
with the win MVP performances in two games out of four so far, both victories for Nancy, Batum has his team in the thick of the top 16 race, ready to challenge any opponents.